Hi, and welcome back to Let's Play StarCraft Legacy of the Void. This is, what, episode four? And we are escaping this collapsing temple. Kill things. Oh, we don't have time for this. Oh, shit. I don't think we have time for this. Keep running, my minions. Oh shit, we really don't have time for this. And use Void Shield as often as possible. This archway has collapsed. I must find another exit quickly. Uh, let's see, existence is pretty good sometimes, you know? I like existence. Oh no. Gotta wait for Blink to cool. Go, guys, go. Oh god. Get out of that. Shit, 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 shit. We're gonna die, we're gonna die. We're gonna die. Oh. No, no, no. Okay. Okay, we gotta wait. Gotta wait, need shields. Couple seconds, we get a burn time to survive. Okay, we give ourselves the shield boost. Run for it. And we made it. Make your escape. I will deal with the Taldari. There must be another way. No. There we go. <laughs> Just needed that last, that last blade kill. Uh, I totally missed the bonus objectives. I think. Or did I? There was probably one more, like, plasma thingy I could have killed to get reinforcements. I think I saw it on the map. Alright, we managed all the objectives there. I do hear there are secret objectives. Alright, so let's see. Let us continue on. Zeratul runs for his life. There's those mammalian characteristics I was talking about earlier. Pretty sure Tassadar, not those Ilzanago, were the ones who gave us the vision, but you know. I mean, Amon seemed kind of reasonable for a dark god. He just doesn't want us to suffer. Alright, Whispers of Oblivion. Was that the whole thing? Fine. On to the main story. Ooh, I forgot to start my clock. This one might be a little longer. All right. Da, da, da. 
Far above the Zerg-infested jungles of Ire, the young hierarch of the unified Protoss, Artanis. That must be... This must be Artanis. He's looking way buffer than I remember. Has assembled the Golden Armada to retake his people's ancient homeworld. As the Templar forces prepare themselves for war, a small band of warriors fight a desperate battle to establish a beachhead within the ruins on the planet's surface. Let's do this. I haven't played this yet. Oh, snap. Oh, the intro cutscenes for campaigns are so good. Blizzard is the best. The swarm brought ruin to our world. All right, Artanis all up on ire. Our proud people became refugees. Happens to other people too, guys. And yet, they could not shatter our unity. The greater good. Oh, For shit. We are bound by the color. The sacred union. They're like communicating avatar style through their ponytails. And emotion. Protoss are awesome. This makes me want to play StarCraft the board game. Which is pretty fantastic. Oh, Banelings en route. This guy's gonna give his life. He can't survive that many Banelings. Aww. Oh. Yep. One Zergling might be enough to take out you guys. Although they have attacks now, or maybe that's not in multiplayer. Perfect enemy against these light Protoss forces. <laughs> that was fantastic. Yes. Arc on toilet. Flush it. Oh. That was awesome. Who's this one eyed guy? Zerg. Multiplayer people everywhere rue the day that that pylon warps in. Speaking of which, if you've never heard the song, if you've never heard any of the Dirt League music, you should totally listen to it because it's fucking fantastic. Uh, got a little excited there. But, um, yeah, the, uh, I Knew You Were Trouble Since You Warped In uh, is a fantastic parody song. Um, and it's just, oh, it's it's utterly amazing. You gotta look up the YouTube video because it's absolutely beautiful. They do their own graphics on top of, I'm pretty sure it's not the actual game engine. It's like prettier than the actual game engine or maybe there are settings that I've never been able to I haven't ever reached all right so legacy of the void a great evil looms over the galaxy the dark god Amon has returned spurred on by Zeratul's prophecies Kerrigan and her swarm set out to destroy Amon's hybrid forces hoping to stop the coming oblivion with the threat of the Zerg queen absent the Protoss hierarch Artanis raised a massive invasion fleet left the dark Templar world of Shakuras and committed to restore his people's former glory by reclaiming their lost homeworld of Ayer. All right. Ayer. The Protoss are never gonna give you up. Never gonna run around desert you. That's right, I just rickrolled you. I'm 
sorry. Yes. Templar. At long last, we stand at the threshold of destiny. For today, we will restore the glory of our legacy. Today, we will retake what we have lost and reclaim our homeworld. And may the Kala's light guide us. The invasion fleet stands ready. We await only your command, Hierarch. You must halt this invasion at once. Zeratul. Templar! Arrest this traitor! No! We will hear him out. The end war has come. Amon, the Dark One, has returned. This heretic cannot be trusted. This invasion is a distraction from the true battle ahead. True. Amon's fury will engulf the entire galaxy. Do not Search your heart, Artanis. You know it to be true. And that burden weighs heavily upon me. Artanis, I have found a way to stand oh, that's right. against the coming When Zeratul struck down one of the um, sub overmind things, he revealed the location of Ayr to the Zerg. But far too many have sacrificed in the hopes that this moment would come to pass. Executor, Search your heart to know it to be true. Invasion. I mean, maybe we need the political clout from retaking Iyer to uh, win over the hearts of our people and organize them into awesomeness. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's good. Sick. Oh, convenient. Colossi. Don't lose don't lose hope or shields. Back up. Do they have the range to siege? Yeah, they do. the store how fast does shields come back I think it's like two a second All we got is Blink and Immortals. Oh, look, it's like a dead Nidus worm. There 
is a Zerg hive cluster near your warriors. If possible, we should destroy it. Okay. Okay, so we lured some out. Well fought, my warriors. Let us return our focus to reclaiming the warp conduit. Sure, sure, they're just giving us a giant death ball. Okay, I want my Colossi on a separate trigger. This F2 button thing is pretty sweet. Hydralis, no match, no, come back. It's always good to give a little bit of time as you let your shields regenerate a little bit. Oh, snap, what is it? It's awesome. Did it just crash? What? Yeah, that'd be good. Oh, what? Okay. Still, pr this is pretty serious, guys. What were our, our extra objectives? I don't know if I saw them. Artemis, there are more hives in the surrounding area. Destroying them would deal the Zerg a crippling blow. Okay. This is the way to go, guys. You want to be nice and efficient. Use your siege weapons. Fifteen damage. They're looking pretty cool over here. Cliff walls, yeah.
hive cluster has fallen. Continue on, brothers. Okay, there is something. Get over there. Firearc, we thank you for your aid. Allow us to join you in battle. I was gonna say they're probably totally into joining us. Alright, we've got some serious death ball going on. Okay, we need the Colossus to do work. We need those guys up front so they can do their anti-armor damage. Burn this out. Watch the mini-map to make sure nothing's sneaking up behind me because, you know, ambushes and plot shit. So far, so good. Casualties at a minimum. Now we crush it. Kill that Nidus Majigger. The second warp conduit is activating now. Psi matrix signal confirmed. Reinforcements warping in at your location. Holy moly. It's too many units. Okay, we'll hold them up there. Colossus can do their brutal work. An unseen hand, it must be the marketplace. Correcting. Okay, here we just go all in. Queen? Is that a flying queen? The final hive has fallen. Let this be the first victory of many. I will be restored. Alright guys, we are so ready. Well, we never killed those, whatever they are. The final conduit lies before us. Show the Zerg no mercy. Alright, I just need people to pull those through, guys. 
Get these stalkers to the front. Oh shit. Aim on, your treachery knows no bounds. Hybrid. Oh, dude, it looks like we're really on top of this. Alright, all bonus objectives, but that's not the same as the little achievement things. Okay, well, at least he's not being dumb. And that thing, we got some Event Horizon thing going on. Kill 120 units with the Colossi in the for okay. Lose fewer than 100 units, nice. We lost 44, pretty good. And we are just now at the 20 minute mark, so I'm gonna stop this recording and I'll see you again next time.